Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Magic Ridge. I'm your host, Ridge, and do I have a treat for you today. Today, we're opening a Zendikar Rising Gift Edition Bundle. All right, and, and today I picked this up at Walmart for $49.98. Ouch. A little pricey, a little pricey, but, uh... Yeah, I'm, I haven't opened much Zendikar Rising product, and I've been wanting to open something like this for a minute now, so we're going to do it here today on the channel. So let's get cracking, dude. Oh, that, was, that, was, that was a good one. All right, let's, let's get in here. Let's get into it. Hopefully I didn't damage the box. Oh, the box looks minty mint. All right. Inside we've got a don't steal stuff. One of these pretty much worthless boxes. I don't, I mean, they're just there to space it out. Let's see, we got this cool little, they didn't used to do these. Whatever this is, a little, little card insert. Not bad, not bad, a little core fella. All right, so let's see what's in this gift edition bundle, shall we? Also, the box is kind of foily. That's cool. I really like these, uh, what are those, like, hedrons? I don't know. I want to call them hedrons because of StarCraft. But, uh, anyway, let's get into this little bad boy. What do you think? Hopefully there's something good. Uh, I know the Commander Legends, uh, little draft packs. I haven't been, uh, doing very great on the pull rate. So, let's get a little something different here going. So also the gift edition, it comes with 10 of the standard draft packs from Zendikar Rising. So that's going to be fun. But it also contains a collector booster, which I don't think I've opened any collector boosters, to be completely honest with you. Um, and then we got a couple other things here. We got a couple... Uh, Little, little rules thing. We got uh, we got our promo or whatever this is that comes in the box. I, get, I think we get like 20 lands and then maybe 20 foil lands. I'm not sure. We'll open that up at the end. It's not very exciting. So, oh, can't forget this. Comes with this really nice oversized spin down. Very nice, very nice. All right. Y'all ready to get cracking? Because I am. How's your day? What are you doing? You know what I'm saying? It's a good day. Let's get in here. All right, first pack. Looks a little mangled. Looks weird. Hopefully there's nothing damaged in there, but I'm ready to get into it. Now, just to clarify, like I said, I haven't opened much of this product. So unless I know the card from some reason for Commander or something... I really have no clue what's in here. We're going to kind of skip the chaff because this is also, and it's been out for a while, so we don't really need to read through these. You can just kind of skim through them here. It's going to be a longer video on my channel. Nice. All right. And here we go. We've got a Ravager's Mace for an Uncommon. we got an Acquisitions Expert, a little rogue, all right. We've got a Zoff Consumption, all right, that's cool. And for our Rare or Mythic, we've got a Tabarax Hope's Demise, Demon Cleric. It's kind of cool, all right. I'm not sure what's behind here. Okay, we got a Full Art Island, cool. And some other stuff. All right, so I will put the rares right here. Maybe foils next to it if I get any. Never know. I'll cover cover this eye up. What do you think? All right, next pack. I want this video to take forever, right? All right. Let's get rid of this. All right, we will skim through these. Dun, 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 dun. What are we going to get? Nobody knows. Well, somebody might know somewhere. 
All right. And we're just going to add on to the equipment for the uncommons here. So we got the Relic Axe. We've got a Rolling Regrowth. All right. We've got a Amara Wizard. And for the rare, Inscription of Ruin. Okay, that's kind of cool. All right. I'll take it. We'll take the planes as well. Friday Night Magic. I hope it comes back. I really would like to play at my local store. Hopefully soon. What are you guys doing? Uh, you know, leave a comment. Do you guys... Have you guys been playing at a store? You got a play group? Do you play Magic the Green, Magic Online or Magic the Gathering Arena? How do you get your daily magic fix? All right. Field research. Broken wings. And we have a sure-footed infiltrator. We have a spoils of adventure. We have a spike field hazard. And for the rare, we have a world sculptor. All right. That's kind of cool. Hey, right. And for our foil, we have a Seagate Colossus. Um, that's just, it's cool. It's not, obviously it's not worth much, but it is seriously something cool. So, I don't know why I put the full arts here. I like the full arts, personally. Alright, so we got one foil so far. And a few cards of, I'm not sure, value. I'm not super excited about them, but I'm not super mad. Alright, let's go for another one. Let's get in here. Go. Let's get it. You know what I'm saying? Alright, we're just gonna we're just gonna pop right here to the uncommons, I think. Let me know in the comments below. Do you like me to skip to the uncommon or do you like me to flip through them? A little feedback would be good. Alright, allied assault. Taunting Arbor Mage. We got an ambush here. All right, all right. And Thieving Skydiver. All right, that's decent. And a mountain. All right, all right. Next. Next in line here. All right. Let's get in here. All right. We're going to skip right here again. We're going to kind of go back and forth because I'm not sure which one I like more, which one's more efficient. All right, we got a mul uh, Merfolk. Falconeer. All right. We have another Spoils of Adventure. Okay. We have a Shelter. All right, all right. And for the rare, Confounding Conundrum. All right, all right. Cool, cool, cool. And a Swamp. Oh, that is a, that is a beautiful Swamp. I really like that. All right. Let's keep this party going. All right. I'm not even sure what the big pulls are in here. I've been opening a lot of Commander Legends. All right, we're gonna we're gonna flip through this one. All right, we got Scorch Rider, Chilling Trap. We got an Outrider, a Silencer, a Dauntless Survivor, Expedition Skulker, Canopy Belloth. We got a Rubble Fort. We got an Ox. We got a Grasp. And for our first uncommon, we got a Veteran Adventurer. Sky Cave. Oh, Sky Clave, rather. Plunder. All right. We have Kazel's Fury. I, I wish they would have put this one in a different slot so I could show you the back of it. All right. So we could see what the other side is. But also then not reveal the rare, which is a... Paragon. Alright, alright. Cool, cool, cool. And an island. Alright, alright. Plant token. Next. Next, next, next. Let's get in here. Alright. So, we're just gonna... We're just gonna do this. Let's just get in here. Alright. Nice, nice, nice. If I see something, I'll point it out. 
Um, all right, we got a Cinderclasm. We have an Amaria Captain. Love the Angels. Uh, this one, not so great. We've got a shelter, and I'm going to hide this so we can see the bottom here. So this is the other side. This is the glacier. Sorry, I'm all over the place. Okay, cool, cool, cool. And for the rare, we have a throne of McKindy. Nice, all right. I'll take that. Planes. Some trash. All right, let's keep going. All right. All right. Cool, cool, cool. So how's everybody's night? How you doing? What's good? All right. My pile's getting crazy over here. I need to make neater piles, I tell you that much. All right, Journey to Oblivion. We have... Uh, a Sproutling, Plant Elemental, and a Veil. And for the rare, we have Skyclave Apparition. Now, I do know a little bit about this. It is white, but apparently this is one of the biggest modern cards that white has had in a long time. Uh, so that's cool. Maybe it's worth something. It's white. It's always worth something to me. All right, let's keep going. Forest, we are down to two packs and then a collector's booster. Let's hope that collector's booster is fire, as all can be fire. All right. Smite the monstrous. All right. We got a blight blade, a blood price, an ox, a grasp, feed the swarm. All right, we got a Brushfire Elemental, Thundering Rebuke, Amara Wizard, and for the Rare or Mythic, we have Kaza Royal Chaser. Okay, all right. And a Mountain. All right. Let's uh, move some of this up here. All right. Let's keep this going. Let's keep going. Let's get hype. This last pack. But a seer, farsight adept, a tormenting voice. Oh, we got feed the swarm. Uh, that is like something new. A little black destroy enchantment. That's definitely something needed. Very cool. Very cool. Got to point that out. Alright, so we get a Vastwood Surge, followed by a Sure-Footed Infiltrator, followed by a War Leader, and for the Rare, we've got a Crag Crown Pathway Flipland, red, red Green, and I just spoiled that there, there's the other side. I really like these lands, to be honest with you. I think they're mad cool. Uh, this is a very good hit in my opinion as well. Uh, Timber Crown Pathway. Crag Crown path Pathway. Very cool. Um, this gift box looks like it's a little damaged out of the box. So that's that's a bummer. Get a little nick up here at top. But uh, that's alright. And we've got a Sure-Footed Infiltrator in Foil. Not a big deal. Swamp. We've got a Goblin Construct Token. That's kind of cool. All right. So, before I go into the other one, we're just going to open this little land pile. I'm just going to look through it real quick. You know, just, just lands. Yep, just a pack of 20 lands. So, I believe the other one is a pack of 20 foil lands, along with this pretty cool crab. I think it's pretty decent. All right, open sesame, open sesame, yep. All right, so we have the the Raging Isle Crab, Leviathan Crab. I really like this guy. He seems decent. 
Um, I haven't seen anybody build them, but looks decent. And then we just get a bunch of foil lands. No full arts, no, no snowy boys, just, just foil lands, which is cool, you know, they are foil, that is a thing. And now for the finale, for the final countdown. I'm pretty stoked, actually, to open this. I, like I said, I've yet to open any collector's boosters, so this will be my first. Hopefully it's a good one, maybe it'll change my mind. Perhaps I will buy some of these collector's boosters when they come out. So we're going to go through these. They're all foil, obviously, if you know how the collector's booster works. And our first card is a scavenged blade. Going with the equipment, so that's cool. I enjoy equipments. We have a chilling trap. We've got a Kazundu stomper. Followed by a Ghastly Gloom Hunter. And a Prowling Felidar. Cat Beast. On occasion, Felidars leave meaty gifts outside the tents of explorers they consider worthy. Alright. We have an Allied Assault. Alright. A Taunting Arbor Mage. For an Uncommon. We've got a foil for uh, full art planes. All right. I like that. I like that. Little, I'll have a home for that. And we have an extended arc Grok Maw Skyclave Ravager. So we got the, I, I say it's extended art, maybe borderless. I'm not sure exactly what this is. And next. All right. All right. We've got a Scourge of the Skyclaves, a Demon, Mythic, and Foil. All right, all right. And then we have a Skyclave, Geop... Geopede, I was going to say Geopod, as uh, an Uncommon. And we got a Rune Crab, that's cool. I enjoy the Rune Crab. Um, not really into Mill, but I really, for some reason, this artwork... The cardstock, however this is, this this border, this really does it for me. I don't, I don't know. There's just something about that. And next we have a Lotus Cobra. All right, all right. That is nice. I'm pretty hyped on that one, to be honest with you. All right, is it? I mean, is there anything else in this pack? Cause there be more. Oh my goodness, I'm, I'm spoiling here. We got a Fearless Fledgling. It's an uncommon, but boy, is that sharp. And what did I just spoil? We have a Coveted Prize in black. This spell costs one less to cast for each creature in your party. Search your library for a card, put it in your hand, then shuffle your library. If you have a full party, you may cast a spell with converted mana cost four or less, from your hand without paying its mana cost. Ah, man, that could that could be good, but I'm the party the whole party thing. It's just not it's not my thing. Not my favorite. But it's sure cool. And anything else? And we got a cat beast token with a hydra token. If you guys have made it thus far, smash that like button. And subscribe for more content. There will definitely be more. I'm going to post as often as I can. Um, I think uh, after this, the uh, Keldheim set's released, I'll start possibly talking about spoilers, what I think. Sometimes I'll talk about speculations, things I speculate to go up in value or something like that. But it, it'd probably be a white card, if anything. Um... So, yeah, thanks for uh, showing up, and uh, have a good night.